So Sketch is gay. Let's talk about it. What's going on, everybody? Look, this has been a wild 24 hours for content creator, streamer extraordinaire, and the internet's most loved NFL Madden streamer, Sketch. So there's been some picture servicing of a guy doing some OnlyFans content where he is seemingly doing gay acts on another person in the uh, the videos. And honestly, a lot of people were in uproar, not because gay OnlyFans content is some sort of crazy thing, but because the person in the video looked a lot like their favorite streamer. Now, somebody was trying to make a joke about how down bad you have to be in order to get to these depths of the internet to find this type of stuff and then you know how the internet goes they start to be detectives start circling forehead dots and matching up eyebrows and stuff like that to start the speculations going but people were pretty sure that this was sketch now look without beating around the bush it's already been confirmed by sketch on a recent stream look at this open and honest that was me that was me it's okay though i will tell you what okay two years ago i did some stuff I'm sorry if you've seen some of the stuff. You know, I'm a changed person. Um, this is going worse than I thought it was. Um, so two years ago, I did not have sexual relations with that man. I'm just kidding. I did. Possibly. <sighs> Catch out of the bag. It's okay. Um, what else do I have to say? I don't know. Thank you to all my people that have been sticking up for me. I understand if you're bad, okay? I was dealing with some addiction problems, a couple of them, but no excuse there. Uh, wait, I guess. Just trying to give you some background background here. What else was I going to say? Yeah, that was me. Um, I fucked up. I won't do it again. And see, the reason why Sketch is having a hard time even talking about some of this stuff is not necessarily because he did anything wrong, but more so that he's embarrassed that it's become this grand spectacle of a thing. Look, I know this may be surprising. Sketch is now possibly more childlike entertainer, a teenager, or whatever the case may be. Um, he's moved into a whole different light as to what's going on right now. But ultimately, he didn't do anything illegal. Maybe people's moral compasses would go against this specifically because of the OnlyFans thing. But from what I've been seeing on the internet is a lot of people have been focusing on the fact that this was gay OnlyFans content as opposed to any other OnlyFans content. I'm pretty sure the reaction from a lot of people would be different if this was straight OnlyFans content. There wouldn't even be a semblance of a word of cancellation, of taking away sponsorship deals, of doing anything of any sort with Sketch if this was him and another woman. But it's not, which is showing that a lot of people are just homophobic in these instances because the only reason why this is an uproar is because this was with another man. This is part of the problem with the internet is the fact that they think that the entirety of your life is defined by whatever you put on the internet he's a completely changed man of course he no longer does only fans if that was your issue now he could still be gay he could still not be gay he could have been bisexual he could be bisexual we don't know his sexual status people should stop labeling his actions for gay or whatever the case may be he said he was addicted to some things didn't go to any details didn't say if it was drugs didn't say if it was sex didn't say if it was whatever but the fact of the matter is sketch is not the person that he used to be he said that and that's okay People live totally different lives in their past and they grow to learn to be better. And we should give grace and space for people to change. Now, what I did find quite impressive was the fact that a lot of people came to Sketch's aid in this conversation by sticking up for him. Okay, first of all, number one, whether Sketch is gay, bi, or straight, why the fuck do you care what another man does, okay? That's just off the rip. So for someone who made a, a, a bunch of you guys laugh and have a good time, for you to go, oh, he's gay now? Fuck him. That's really fucked up. But again, if you just never cared about him, whatever, it's fine. I say what you want there now there are a lot of people who did stand up for sketch in these regards so good on all of them los pollos duke dennis phase everybody that stood up for him but of course there had to be some people who thought that what he was saying was wrong tyreek hill goes to the internet and says sketch done played all of y'all also this is very funny coming from tyreek hill knowing that he's a woman and child beater i i don't i there's proof of that that's on the internet i don't know why that's so crazy now maybe because in the nfl there's like this rampant anti-homosexuality stance that a lot of the players have but literally there is no need for anybody to get this off i don't know how people are saying that he played us or anything like that because of the simple fact that he didn't forward out tell us his sexual preferences or that he participated in OnlyFans. where do those conversations even come up in when we're having normal conversations i think another thing that really pisses me off in this situation is the fact that people are again running with stories and making up things they're making fake screenshots about the nfl abandoning sketch in this time although this isn't really a time but ultimately these ended up being fake 
take screenshots about him and the situation because none of this is true like if you go on these pages none of this just so happens to be true these people are lying on sketch for no reason i also find it strange that if all these people had issues with sketch being gay or being outed or whatever the case may be they are not as vocal about you know when other content creators do seemingly gay things they still use them because that's what all this is is people using people for example aiden ross has plenty of tweets and plenty of actions on the internet that people would deem gay and they still hang around him or whatever the case may be but that's just because they know they can use him and like lo said which i agree with if you're just around a use sketch that's perfectly fine you never cared about him but don't act like you cared about him and now this is some big switch up or reveal tyreek hill after you've been on multiple streams with him the people that are not going to continue to be cool with him after being cool with him are weird as hell to be honest bro i don't give a fuck Y'all shouldn't give a fuck. It's not y'all. It's not y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like, if, if that's not what you into, then that's not... If that's not what you into, then that's... It shouldn't even be that big of a deal. You know what I'm saying? So I, I think y'all dragging it. And that's even assuming if it's real. If it's real, cool. If it's not cool thank you captain atlanta we needed your words of wisdom here and to add on to duke's point even if sketch didn't change then i don't think that there should be a problem with this either now again if you have the stance that there is something immoral at the fact that he's doing only fans i think that's a totally different conversation but if you're focused on the fact that he is gay in this situation i don't know what to say like he's a genuine guy like duke said and supposedly this phase collective that said that they were cool with these people or all of them were friends should have no problem still sticking around him in the wake of all this um, I'm not gay. I don't got to gay people. Um, if people are like so mad hate towards gay people, that's y'all. Right? Um, I joke and I might say some bullshit. I, I, we, we all do that shit with our mans. You feel me? But it's never nothing. No, no, that ass serious shit. I'm not on none of that. You feel me? I love women. I love, you feel me? Like people would say, oh my God, like, oh, yo, that's, that's, that's what a typical in the closet, guy would say, cool. Niggas is gonna try to make shit weird. Niggas gonna try to make shit, oh, birds of a feather flock together. No. Silky, nobody is assuming that you are gay in this situation. You are turning this into a weird situation now. <clears throat> so a couple things. One, uh, niggas on my comm that I was talking about leaving because I defended my friend because he had some shit going on in the past and he's moved on. Uh, bitch ass nigga leave the fuck. Uh, yo, I don't think niggas understand. We don't care about you. Nigga, if you're not phased, you're not five star, you're a fucking bitch. I defended my friend. If that shit hurts you and make you want to cry and stop watching my content because I defended my friend, a real life personal issue, and just get the fuck out. See, that's more like it. That's a more suitable response to this situation if you are genuine friends. Now, Silky, if you're not, then you are revealing everything that I believe to be true. And what I was saying in my past video about FaZe is that they took this collective and they stuck them together. But you may be a one-off and I can give you that. I think all these people that are making it about anything else besides sticking beside him that are specifically in FaZe are definitely weird. I liked what FaZe Bank said about, hey, you're a friend. These people are weirdos. Come back around. That's very supportive. I don't like what Silky is doing. That's weird. And I hope people address him for it. Another thing that I saw on the internet is the fact that he didn't tell people that he was gay or he was in the closet. I think Bruce Dropamoff spoke about it. So everybody that's, oh, yeah, he's still my mans. Uh, uh, of course he's still y'all mans because he bring y'all a fucking paycheck. Y'all gotta save his face. Look how fucking brand brandable he is. Brandable. Brandable. Niggas can do sex work brandable you can't say nigga though it's not brandable white folks can get fucked on cam by black dick and go announce a nigga to fucking in the nfl gang but a real deal nigga who play madden all day with the green screen and sweating this shit gets no love i don't know his name chat but i'm fighting for all black creators at this motherfucking point like i've been doing it's not about you being gay gang it's about you not telling nobody <laughs> and hiding it and coming a whole different alias like you're a new person that's not cool bro at all you got kids that watch you game my little brother watch you bro and i'm not allowing him to watch you no more because you're just trying to cover this shit up like it's okay for you to be gay nobody cares bro nigga i did a stream with brandon a fucking barber if you think i'm homophobic think that i don't give a fuck but all that sex shit i know that's gonna become a troll because y'all niggas troll about the p diddy shit all that shit i don't give a fuck y'all niggas don't take shit like this serious with kids now where i think bruce drop him off kind of misses the mark is the fact that sketch can change people can change you don't have to be what you are in the past if you dedicate your life to be something totally different i don't think that people are always their past especially when we saw him for the past couple of months rise to fame 
same and none of this showed up in any sort of sign before you had no idea that he was into sex work you had no idea that he was gay you had no idea that he was doing anything like this before so clearly he was doing something right it just took one weirdo from the internet who did this deep dive and then decided to put his personal business on blast to say oh this is who i am etc etc this is who sketch is bruce i would want you to think that people 20 years from now don't think that you are still the guy that you were when you were 20 years old i would hope nobody ever thinks that but hey if you decide to do what you do nobody can stop you i would just say that you're wrong in the fact that people can't change people do change people change all the time look i think this is a non-issue to the people that are out there saying once a sex worker always a sex worker i think that you're silly to the people that are getting on him because he's gay i think that that's even crazier to say ultimately sketch you do what you want to do but as a word of advice to the people that are seeking to do sex work on the internet this is a real possibility and you'll never know where you'll be 10 years down the line ultimately i don't think this will harm any of his relationships or his bag that he has going out but this is a psa to all the people thinking about doing sex work don't do it let me know what you guys are thinking